Majority of mainstream news sources have gone all in over President Trump's latest meeting with Vladimir Putin and remarks made after the fact. Other former presidents have met with Putin and have had high interest in Russia, but have never faced the degree of attacks that we are currently witnessing with the media inside America. And President Trump had no problem calling them out on it in a recent Twitter smackdown. On Friday, President Trump unloaded statements in retaliation for MSM's negative coverage in regards to his pursuit of a stronger bond with Russia. This all comes despite Trump acknowledging that Russia likely played a part in meddling with the 2016 election. President Trump said, The fake news media is going crazy. They make up stories without any backup, sources or proof. Many of the stories written about me, and the good people surrounding me, are total fiction. Problem is, when you complain you just give them more publicity. But I'll complain anyway. The president continued his thrashing of the media and exposed the exact sick thing they are after with their latest attacks. Trump said, The fake news media wants so badly to see a major confrontation with Russia, even a confrontation that could lead to war. They are pushing so recklessly hard and hate the fact that I'll probably have a good relationship with Putin. We are doing much better than any other country. President Trump ended his argument by commending one news source, Fox News, for covering the situation fairly. Trump said, Trump recognized Russian meddling many times. Thank you to at folks and friends and at Fox News for actually showing the clips. The fake news wants no part of that narrative. Too bad they don't want to focus on all of the economic and jobs records being set. Thank goodness we have a president who isn't afraid to call the mainstream news out for their shady tactics. Although we don't suspect this will cause them to tame down the attacks, Trump's latest remarks at least show Americans why they should continue to be skeptical of who they are listening to when it comes to news.